Hello, welcome in this MOOC on Global Health. I am delighted to introduce this new MOOC, which will involve a couple of colleagues, distinguished speakers from uh, the University of Geneva, but also the Graduate Institute of Geneva, and all the Geneva International set of organizations. This MOOC is on global health. What is global health? For sure, global health is global, geographically speaking, meaning worldwide cross-border issues in public health. But global health is also an interdisciplinary overview of the problems. This is the purpose of our MOOC. Global health is also addressing complex issues, complex system, complexity of this world. Do not say, this is easy, I will solve the problem with easy solutions. It is very rarely that, and you will see why. Global Health also address and commit some affordable innovation for the help, for the good of public global health, meaning that global health needs technology, needs low-cost, high-tech technologies. Global health also need to have some reflections on sustainability. We need to address all these issues with and find solutions which are sustainable. There is no place for throw away society in global health when we tackle the issues of global health problems. And I will say also that global health need to involve some normative framework, the normative framework of the human right. We need to address equity. It is a scandal to see so such inequity in our world regarding health, regarding the life expectancy between countries, but also within the countries. So what I will say is that in this MOOC you will find several, seven modules. A module is a kind of week. You will spend a module each week where you can uh, learn through videos, through quiz, through exercises, through case studies. Each week will be delimited as a module in a specific um, theme. The first module addresses all the social determinants of health. You know, the major determinant of health is income. Of course, the richer, the wealthiest you are, the better is your probability of having and keeping and maintaining a good health. So we will address all these inequity issues and how to improve equity in terms of health and of global health. The second module will address the cross-border issues of pandemic, epidemic, neglected tropical disease, all these communicable set of diseases which need some international commitment to try to control, to prevent them. The third module will address the growing issues of aging in our societies, not only in the north, in the global north. Of course, the developed countries faced the issues of aging for a long time now, but the emerging countries and the developing countries are now needing to tackle both uh, issues, the communicable emerging infectious disease issues, but also these non-communicable disease problems and chronic disease problems, including cancers, including mental health issues. The fourth and the, the fifth modules will address both governance problems, governance uh, in global health, meaning how 
internationally it is coordinated, how we can put some priorities uh, thanks to these international organization systems of the United Nations and also on private public partnerships and also on NGOs like Médecins Sans Frontières or for the public private partnership like the GAVI, the Alliance for Vaccine Initiative, and also FIND and also DNDI. Many, many organizations concur to better global health. The fifth will address the questions of global health diplomacy. How vaccines can be a kind of weapon in terms of diplomacy, a weapon for the good, not a weapon for killing, a weapon for the good of the global health. The sixth module will address all these issues of research, and innovations. We have said that innovations, innovative solutions, may really bring some better health in the world. Of course, biotech with vaccines and with drugs, but also devices, but also diagnostic. Many, many innovative solutions may really help solving many problems in terms of global health. And the seventh module will address the problems of environment and sustainability. You know and you will know that health is not only a matter of humans. You need to address also the health of animals if you want to keep the health of humans. There is a lot of interactions between humans and animals. There is a lot of issues also involving the global environment of our health. Climate change, of course, is such and important issues regarding health, not only communicable disease, but also because of flooding, because of the rise of sea levels, because of many uh, issues related to global warming, and maybe also because of the loss of production, the loss of incomes in certain countries due to the global warming. So, all these issues, we are not pretending to be comprehensive. There is a lot of avenues for uh, other developments in this MOOC, but that will be an introduction which will give you the main factors, the main drivers of global health. So thank you for attending this MOOC and we wish you a pleasant journey in this MOOC.